to that brings us to that brings us to the end, which is which is hard to hard to believe. Uh, I'll just I'll just speak briefly uh, for a few minutes, and then then we can all go and enjoy the weekend. Uh, so this was the second running of the workshop on reproducibility, and having done the first one by myself, I'd like to thank um, Esther and Cal and Natalie and. Helen and Suze, um, all of whom did so much work uh, behind the scenes to make this conference happen with very little work from me. Uh, uh, and this second running of the workshop on reproducibility was put together with the Canadian Statistical Sciences Institute of Ontario, uh, so CANSI Ontario. I'll just put that link in the chat. And we have a lot of money and we're keen to give it to statisticians from Ontario. And it was also uh, put together with the U of T Data Sciences Institute. And I'll put that link in the chat. And they have an awful lot of money and they are keen to give it to data scientists at U of T. Um, so please apply to, to those programs uh, so that we or they can give some of it to you. And I think that there's a lot of disagreement between statisticians and computer scientists as to what exactly is a data scientist? But I think that one thing that we're all very lucky uh, to, to be in the, we're, we're all very lucky at the moment because data science is in demand right now. And there's just an awful lot of money floating around. And a lot of it, especially for those of us at universities is public money. And so that is one reason that I think that we have this uh, duty to ensure that our work can be built on by others and, and hence why reproducibility is important um, so that we're not being wasteful with that public's money. And so I love Michael's challenge to us, which was just to try and do a little bit more each time. And so hopefully next year, uh, we can all hang out in person and we can all tell Michael about all the improvements uh, that, we, that we all made. Uh, I'd also like to thank the co-leads of the U of T Data Sciences Institute on um, Data Science Institute on um, reproducibility. So Ben and Jay, and also the director of both CANSI Ontario and the DSI Lisa, and all of them were were also instrumental in the organisation of this of this um, of this workshop. And all of the all three of them are sort of these just incredible first rate scientists, but they're also just have been just terrific friends, um, giving so much advice and guidance to me, even though they barely, you know, barely know me. And I think that that maybe is one additional thing that those of us who care about reproducibly also need to think about carefully, because one of the common phrases that I think that we heard was that uh, presenters would say, well, you know, I, I don't need to convince anybody about how important reproducibility is um, at this conference, right? And, and that, that's a fairly reasonable reasonable thing to say here. Uh, but I, I do think that a lot of our colleagues, uh, they do know that they, and they do want to be a little bit more reproducible um, in, their, in their work. And I think that they're perhaps, some of them are looking to people like us, um, to not necessarily tell them where they're going wrong, but they just want to know what's one step that they could take. And so I think that one more task, um, in addition to Michael's challenge to us, uh, which was to do a little bit better for ourselves, I think that one more task for the, for the, for the next year is to just make one, one friend in our own disciplines and go out of our way to sort of help them just one, add one small reproducibility tool to their workflow. And if that's Git, then, then, that, then that, that's great. And if that's Zenodo, then, then you know, that's even better. And if that's make, uh, then, then I would like help with that. <laughs> uh, uh, but I do think that if we can just help one, uh, one other person that that can have a big effect because academia is, is just one small community. We all sort of know each other and we are the ones that gets to teach the folks um, who will go out and do all of this stuff in industry. So hopefully next year we can all uh, come and meet in person and tell Michael how we all improved our our workflows and, and we can all also bring a bring a friend along. Uh, and so thank you very much to to everyone, all of the presenters for all of your hard work in terms of um, in terms of um, putting together your talks. Um, I just really appreciate it and really grateful for all of your all of your time and I hope that everyone has a very nice weekend. Uh, thanks everyone. <laughs>